The Core Rochester Mine, located 28 miles east of Lovelock, Nevada, will begin construction of Phase 1 of their Plan of Operations, Amendment Number 11, in early 2021. The project will consist of a new crushing circuit, heap leach pad, Merrill Crow processing plant, and ancillary support facilities. Construction of the Crusher Corridor will begin with the excavation for the stockpile reclaimed feeders and tunnels, which will be constructed and backfilled. The primary crusher will accommodate dual 200 ton haul trucks dumping into the crusher at the same time and crushing 77,000 tons per day. The control room in the primary crusher will control operation of the crushing circuit. Ore will be discharged to the coarse ore stockpile and then conveyed to the secondary crusher. The secondary crusher will utilize apron feeders, vibrating screens, and two cone crushers. Ore will then be conveyed to the secondary stockpile and then to the tertiary crusher which will utilize two HPGR crushers. As ore is conveyed from the tertiary crusher, lime will be added to the conveyor. Ore will then be stored in the final product stockpile, which will feed the truck loadout. The Merrill Crow process plant will use seven clarifiers, then remove dissolved oxygen in two crow towers. Then zinc will be added to precipitate metals, which will then be filtered through four filter presses. Geomembrane will be deployed on the pad. Collection piping will then be deployed and then covered by overliner, which will be transported from the site's existing crushing circuit. Before the new crushing circuit is energized, the Oriana substation will be upgraded. The existing 60 kV power line will be replaced and upgraded to a 120 kV line and the new Panama substation will be constructed just west of the new Merrill Crow building. The pad will be stacked with trucks loaded from the new truck loadout. This expansion project allows Rochester to continue to operate well into the future.